When Southern Miss came in here, they were had were getting votes at that time for the top 25, and with Weatherspoon and the Jet All American, they had signed a, a freshman. I don't remember his name. That was a, a Whitby was a high school All American player, so they came in undefeated. We were undefeated, and, and I thought it was a great basketball game. I thought one of the better games that we played in the seven years that I've been here. I thought it was one of the better played games here, I and mean, they played very well. We played very well. I think that uh, gave us some notoriety, and uh, certainly, yeah, again, all these early games are confidence builders, and that gave us more confidence. Southern Miss game was 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 great uh, here in the dome. Uh, it was a great atmosphere. I, re I recall, uh, you know, going up against an All American like you said, Clarence Weatherspoon. Uh, you know, uh, uh, if that doesn't get you going, you know, then there's nothing. Uh, Nothing that can get you going and get pumped up to play a Southern Miss. You've got not only Clarence but some other great athletes as well. And I think everybody was just real excited for that, you know, to play that game, win, lose. I think everybody was just up to be able to play that game, ready to play. It's always good to play against some good competition like that because, you know, you, you got some people like, you know, Weatherspoon and uh, Wisby and Courtney and all them in there. I think, you know, that's some guys that, you know, it's going to be up in the pro one day. You know that. You gotta go out and play your best against them, or you're just gonna get killed. So I think it's good to play against some competition like that. James Madison was I looked at the film of that game the other day, and that's an unbelievable game. I mean, we had those people 35 points at one time, and uh, they left here and go on to the Cater Bowl, the Sugar Bowl, and lose one game, and they get on the streak. And they win about 10 or 12, and end up, I think, either co-champions in the league or maybe second. I don't and go to the NIT. They were a very good basketball team, and. That was one of our better efforts of the year. Really, really helped us. Knowing that we was going to have to play James Madison, um, I really wanted to win that game um, very bad because you know, I have a friend that plays there, and that game really meant a lot to me, you know, to get off to a great start, um, our team and myself. Um, it just felt great. It felt great uh, getting the victory over Lefty Giselle. We knew that it was going to be tough, and we knew Lefty was a good coach and all. And I, I think we was just we was really, really up for that game. You know, it was close to break and after that game everybody got to go home. And I don't think everybody just wanted to play and get it over with. I think everybody just really wanted to go out there and give a good effort and go home on a good note. And that's 